of new alteration hitting? Bro, bro, hold up, hold up. Did we just invent a spear? Welcome to Ancestors, the Humankind Odyssey, one of the most unique survival games you might ever lay your eyes upon. It sets place 10 million years ago, and we are going to be playing as a family, a clan, a tribe of ancient, maybe not ancient, whatever the word is, for extremely old primates. And we are going to be going through evolution and evolving our species all the way to the point where they can craft and they become smarter and we advance the knowledge of our tribe and just dude it's so freaking cool especially because it sets place as you guys are seeing in a pretty brutal world these are all dangers that we are going to need to be facing as well and it is going to be up to us to try and survive adapt and even battle against some of these different types of enemies and outsmart them utilizing our ever-evolving brains the additional skills that we're gonna learn holy guacamole apparently burps i might be able to burp them away and all sorts of jazz like that it's a massive open world absolutely gorgeous it is ancestors the humankind odyssey and this is gonna be our story now, things are a little bit crazy because if everyone in our tribe dies, it's game over. I don't think we can, like, resume our progress. It's pretty much GG, no re. So this is the beginning before us. And this, well, I'm assuming this is us. You guys can actually see that little tribe, little clan over here that we have going. We can advance this tribe by, you know, uh, whatchamacallit, having additional babies, letting them grow up, and overall just trying to... I think we can even, like, migrate and, like, find new homes and stuff like that. It's seriously insane survival, and, uh, well, it's a rather beautiful game as well. We got ourselves... Oh, Jesus! That's a massive bird! Well... That's not good. Oh, that is extra not good. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, Jesus. Well, this is off to a riveting start. New objective, regain safety in a hiding spot or in your clan settlement. We can click Y because I'm using a controller over here for intelligence, which allows us to uh, tap Y to use your intelligence used to identify hiding spots, your clan settlements, or other helpful items. Okay. Let me, oh, I accidentally paused. Oh, let me unpause over there. Let's dismiss that. Uh, so this is a very dangerous world. And as you guys can see, we are freaking out with our primitive brains over here. These are all like, I think just things that we're kind of being scared of. We got to try and find like a hiding spot or something. Don't move LS to stay in intelligence. Look around, highlight a point of interest and follow the steps. Is that a point of interest over there? Uh, yes, I think so. So I... Hiding spot. Okay, so we got to make our way over to that hiding spot. If we press Y, we can memorize in the location of anything you have identified. It can be memor- God dang, I keep on pressing pause. It can be memorized. Intelligence can also be used to discover practical items and to visualize the things you have identified. Now we just got to kind of sneak our way over there. We got to be very careful because there are predators that we can run into. We can use X for our senses. We can use B for hearing, sense of hearing. Don't move to stay in senses. This is the representation of the sounds within range. Look around to target a sound, then follow the steps. So this is kind of like, we got all these different senses and stuff that we can use. Oh, did I forget the hiding spot already? You want me? What? All right, well, I think that we're all like locked in on that. There we go. Now I think I properly set it up. But the pretty interesting thing is that as we do evolve individually, right? There's like random mutations that our offspring can have and kind of like in in the way that evolution would work It's something that we can experience. Okay, dude. We got to get across this water. This is sketchy. Jump! Haul up! Haul booty, boy! Haul booty! We got to get over that hiding spot. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I don't know if there's actually predators nearby or what, but I can't imagine that this game's the most forgiving. Holy guacamole. Can we make our way over to this hiding spot? Okay, I think we'll be good. I think we'll be good. We well, guys saw some of the dangers that we got. Hello? Am I good now? Oh, there we go. Let's hide. Yep. I am out. Now, with this situation that has arisen, I think we should be able to actually take another member from our clan. Yep. And find the lost child of our clan. So here you guys can see our little starting home. We got a couple of our buddies. What's up, Chad? What's up, uh, Charlie? How you guys doing? Here we got little Timmy. And here we got some of the controls as well. But things will get more advanced. We will learn like crafting recipes and I'm definitely not going the right way. Or maybe I am. 
Which way do I go? Identify? Oh, growing a neuron. That's what you guys are seeing. We have actually gained intelligence. And as we gain intelligence, that's how we can unlock like new crafting recipes, new skills, all sorts of stuff like that. And I think that we got that memorized now. What is this actually? Is this like a new plant or something we could try? Oh, delicious. Let me intimidate the plant. Run, plant, run! <laughs> I think we've intimidated the plant into being delicious. Let me go ahead and eat that and inspect it with X. And I don't know if anything that important has happened, but we have gained more neurons. But right now I'm kind of a little bit prioritized. I gotta find this little baby. I have no clue where this baby is. Can I drop off this plant in my hand? Can I, can I just inspect it? Oh, there we go. Let me look at the plant. What a fancy looking plant. Oh, it's a tool? Well, there you go. We have we just discovered a little bit of a tool. We will drop that off for now. That's right. Look after my plant, boys. Look after it. We got quite the dangerous journey ahead of us. Now, why don't we actually try and do what the monkey do? And actually, why don't we, like, climb up yay, on one of these trees and try to get a little bit of a better vantage point. And I reckon we'll be a little bit safer up here as well. But, yo, I'm gonna need your guys' help here because, well, there's a lot of dangers between us and my child. Well, not my child, but the clan's child. And, well, I kind of want to go and save him. Oh, my God, that's a big nest over there. Hold on, I'm curious about this. We can also take fall damage and stuff. We do need to be careful. Where am I right now? I am not a... Yeet! Oh, swing it and jump it. Dude, this is lit. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. Jesus. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this whole jumping around thingy, my bob. Yo, your boy is trying to make an omelet. Hold up, I'm sorry, child. Oh, Jesus, almost fell off over there. Uh, your boy's got some, uh, what appears to be eggs he's got to steal. I want that Sunday morning omelet, you dig? Oh, oh no. Is that who I think it is? Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus, no, 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 no. Okay, absolutely whiff that jump. Oh. I gotta work on my climbing skills. I'm gonna walk over there. Oh no. Nice, 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 nice. And can I take some of these eggs? Analyze clan member. Yeah, let's do that. Neuronal analysis. Analyzing the corpse of a friend generates neurons. As for other actions, use it for evolution. Okay, so that's what I was talking about, the evolution. I'm pretty sure, I keep pressing pause. So yeah, that's uh, the dude who just died. Uh, I will intimidate his dead body. Yeah, that's right. Well, can I not steal these eggs? Like, actually? Oh, there we go. Let me grab one of those. Yeah, you know what? This is what you get. This is what you get, bird, for killing my buddy. I'm throwing your eggs off. That's what you get. You kill one of my friends, I will kill your babies. All right, now I'm actually going to go and try to grab one of these for home. Because, so again, I want an omelet for little Timmy by the time we uh, get back. Oh, do I still have the egg? No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. I, that was horrifying. That was absolutely horrifying. Okay, where is home? Oh, it's up there. There's all our clan members and stuff. Yeah, I gotta work on my parkour skills. Think that goes without saying. Honey, I got breakfast. Breakfast? Yeah, we got a little bit of breakfast right here. Let me just, boop, drop that over there. If anyone's hungry, I got an egg for y'all. Now, if you'll excuse me, I still got to figure out exactly where I'm trying to go. Oh, mushrooms. Nice. What up, mushrooms? Let me inspect that. Oh, did I forget to inspect the eggs? Very nice. New food. African agaric fungus. Will this kill me? I don't know, but I'm going to eat it. What's going on? Am I getting fuller? I'm not sure what just happened. My guy looks like there's weird things going on with my senses. Am I tripping? Oh no. <laughs> I hope I'm not tripping. This would not be the time. There's a child lost. This is not the time to be out of my mind. Oh, I found him. I found the little Timmy. Or Timmy number two, whatever you want to call him. Yeah, yes, yeah, go, let's go, let's go. No, that's a full grown one. What's up, dude, you cool? Hey buddy, would you like to join my clan? Let me just jump off of there. What's up, my dude? How are you? You okay? You just... Uh, are you dabbing? What's wrong? Did he break his arm? 
I don't know. We have strength in numbers, though. I don't think we're gonna be attacked with two of us. Is this a snail? Hello, snail. Matured neuron. Oh, very nice. Let's inspect this snail. I don't know if I should be eating this snail. Definitely sketchy. New food discovered. Giant African snail. I'll eat it. YOLO. What's the worst that could happen? I get poisoned? Nah, no way. No way. Adaptable metabolism. I just evolved, I think. I got nutrients from a mollusk. Yeah, so I don't know. This guy looks like he broke his arm or something. He doesn't seem like he needs help or anything. Uh, I'm going to continue looking for my little baby. Uh, oh, could that be it? Well, let's focus up on that. Identify and memorize? Yeah, let's see what this is all about. Looks like there's something interesting over here. Inspect. Dude, there's like scary looking eyes coming from here. New gathering spot. Oh, I found a little fishing spot. Hey, hills, yeah, brother. We're kind of like learning our surroundings a little bit. This is cool, this is cool, this is cool. Let's go back to our intelligence. Hmm. We still got that dude over there. I got no clue what kind of help he needs or what's going on. Uh, I feel like we might be close to the kid though because we are like right by a river, right? And I swear that this kid was by a river too. We gotta be close, man. Seriously, guys, you know what I think we need to save this child? I think we need your guys' help. And there's no more helpful way of getting that help. And smash the bejesus out of that like button. Smash it, baby. Because this kid is lost. And listen, if you, if you don't smash that like button, I guess that means that you want our baby monkeys to get lost. That That's cruel. So you should smash that like button and that will make you a good person. That's pretty much what we have just established. You know, and if we get enough likes, we might be able to save this baby. Because right now the power of me looking alone is not enough to find this little kid. Dude, there are so many hidey holes. Like, where could you be hiding, you little twat? What's that over there? <gasps> oh, I found the kid! I found the kid! Let's freaking go! Let's go! After way too much searching, we finally found this little twat. Kitty! Oh, this is thanks to you guys. Like, I'll say the power of the like button. Never underestimate it. This child... Oh, we gotta go and comfort this little kid. Thank you guys so much for helping us, aiding us in finding this thing. So tap B and then wait for answers to progressively comfort the kid. Lower the temperature and take the time to listen. So I gotta comfort him. And every time after he responds, I gotta respond back. And, oh, we did it. We saved the kid. Dude, I'm gonna be waiting. I need a key from the mayor. Okay, no, I am the mayor now. Look at me. I am the mayor now. I, I am the mayor of this settlement. So now we got to go and save this little munchkin. Uh, where is home, by the way? Is it up there? I don't know. We just got a communication neuron of some sort. Oh, what's going on, dude? It just got really dark and spooky. What was that all about? I don't know, but I reckon we kind of got to go up this way. So let's get to climbing. I feel a little bit slower with this kid on my back. Is that good or bad? I don't know, but I think we gotta climb up this cliff. Maybe do a little bit of parkour. I think that little circle at the bottom, by the way, I think that's our stamina. Oh, am I falling? Oh, that was sketchy. Oh, yeah, so let's try and jump over onto this ledge. Jump! Jump! Oh, oh. Nice, 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 nice. And oh, I think we're back. Ladies and gentlemen, hold the applause. I have rescued a child. That's right. That's right. I see you. Check it out. We got an egg. We got a leaf. We got our kid back. This is the most successful episode of Ancestors, the Humankind Odyssey. Although this cutscene makes me feel like another giant bird's just gonna swoop in, so I don't know. By the way, if any of you guys have tips or tricks that you guys might already know from watching Ancestors, I saw a lot of comments like saying that like you guys were seeing videos on this already and you wanted to see me check it out. And it seems like a really cool game and like a very unique survival scenario. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are you smelling me? What's this about? Whoa, whoa, we squaring up. What's going on? Are, are we excited that, that we're back home alive? Maybe, maybe that was the mom or dad. 
And they were just like, my kid's back! And they were given like very thankful hugs and high fives. Uh, so, alright. What next? What next? We gotta like, uh, Avatar's vitality. Energy is limited by stamina, is limited by life expectancy. Eat well, drink well, and sleep well to maintain a great stamina. Avoid injuries and poisonings to maintain your life expectancy. Interesting. Contextual actions. Stop moving to see all the contextual actions offered. They vary according to your situation. Cool, 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 cool. Can I like fall asleep here or something? Is that a thing that I could do? Oh, a rock. Can I analyze this rock? Yeah. Hold X to inspect any item you have in your hand. That's right, boys and girls. I have found the rock of Rockitude. And it's a new tool. A granite rock that we've discovered. Very nice. So, uh, I will drop you now. I no longer need that rock. When R discovered items, dropped items can be stockpiled with identical items. Oh. So I might be able to, like, grab more rocks and create a giant rock stockpile. Uh, yeah. Oh, baby, look at this. Oh, 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 oh. Some items can lead to construction possibilities when in a stockpile. Depending on their number. Oh, baby. As a primitive ape, I enjoy putting stuff into a pile. Look at that. Oh, we're even learning to stack now. Next thing you know, we're gonna invent Jenga. Why don't we grab a stick? Let's inspect this stick. Yes, look at the stick. Oh. My guy's a little bit baffled by this thing. But he discovered a new tool. A dead branch. Can I inspect it again? Does anything new happen? Did I just lick it? I think my guy just licked that branch. Interesting. Let's gather a couple of these branches and make a little bit of a pile. Start organizing some resources here for our little tribe. I don't know. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! What'd that say? Start construction? What are we building? I don't know. We're building it, though. Dude! What's going on? What am I building? Am I building a bed? Am I building a nest? I don't know. I'm just- I'm just hitting the branches. Oh! What did we just build? A branch barrier? Yo! What? We can build barriers? Dude! That's actually lit. What? So we can strategically put those branches down and literally just block off entire entryways. Oh, that is incredibly cool. Dude, what? Okay, so we've just learned how to build a wall. I might need to do that. So we're in a pretty defensible position here. Maybe like wall off that little cave entrance right there. Maybe the river. And we'll be pretty well defended. So we can probably like climb out of here. We got this giant branch actually. Oh, let's see where this goes to. But yeah, if you guys are enjoying this series and want to see more, definitely let me know by hitting that like button and saying so in that comment section down below. That's like the best way of voicing your opinion that you want more. And I know this is, it's still a survival game, but it's a little bit different from what we usually check out. So I kind of do want to get you guys' feedback on it a little bit. And I could definitely learn this, right? What? Look at how colorful that thing is. You're telling me... Oh, what's that up there? What's that up there? Hello? Dead hominid. Oh, yeah. That's my freaking... Oh, that's that thing, unfortunately. Oh, what is monkey doing climbing up? Oh, are you about to get yeeted by that bird? I hope not. Whee! Hello, tribe. It is I, the inventor of this stick wall. No need to thank me. Next thing you know, I'm gonna invent the wheel. Just give it some time. Yeah, let's go ahead and lie down. And let's take a little bit of a nap, shall we? Nope, keep holding it. Okay, I gotta keep holding it, that's why. And we sleep. Does this just like fast forward time or something? I guess so. Oh, what is that? There's the ghost. You guys see this ghost on the left hand side? And yeah, daily regimen update. Sleep good, we need more food, we need more water. So we gotta go on the hunt for that. Got it. Oh, what is this? I learned, is this something new? Hey, another new thing too. Let's go. New food, oh nice. We just got some food growing here. That's nifty. Don't mind if I do. Oh, the kid wants him? Get out of here. This is my horse tail. 
Oh, adaptable metabolism. Assimilated nutrients from the vegetable type of food. Very cool. What am I analyzing? Oh, some of the other people here. Hello. Oh, we found some sort of a fruit here. Can we do anything with this? Is this like another type of food? Nice. What did we find this time? Berries. Oh, baby. Dude, we're finding all sorts of food for our diet. We got to share with this little brat on our back. But besides that, not too bad. We continue adapting our metabolism. Very nice. Oh, these are new types of rocks, aren't they? These look like special rocks. Is this flint? Did we just discover flint? New tool discovery. Obsidian. Oh. I still don't know what that does, but... Why don't we start making a pile of it? And maybe we can invent something, yeah? Add the pile. Having children around allows the accumulation of neuronal energy. More children around means more accumulation. I just want to try to evolve a little bit. I just gotta find like a place to lie. Oh, there's the sleep spot. When built, a sleep spot is the basis of every settlement. Tap A to lie down on a sleep spot. And we actually just learned how to build one too, but check it out. We tap Y. And this is how we can evolve. And you guys can actually see our neuronal network. This is like our brain pretty much evolving. And we can kind of pick and choose how we want to evolve. So currently, can we learn this? Knit as an increased capacity to metabolize food. The spontaneous genetic mutation will be defined once knit reaches childhood. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. So can I like pick one of these or does it just kind of like show where we're growing? Oh, there we go. Neuronal growth is complete. Assign neuronal energy to initiate a new motor skill. And we just learned the ability to switch hands with an item equipped. Well, well, well. Ain't that fancy. We've unlocked new skills as well that branches out from there. Uh, we still need more training for some of these. I don't think we can really get, like, any of these right now. But they should be available to us soon. Uh, that one's still growing. That one's still growing. We still need more training. So I don't think there's anything we could really learn at the moment. I think we've maxed out for the most part. But I imagine that there's more... Oh, we got two reinforcements. What? Use points to lock knowledge. Okay. Passing a generation is irreversible. There will be no coming back and all unborn babies will be lost. Okay, I don't think I want to do that yet. I still have no clue what that means. And here's our evolution. To launch an evolution, you must be at your clan's active settlement, have passed at least one generation, and succeeded in evolution feat. What in tarnation? Uh, explore, expand. Yeah, this is all just like blurry. I got no clue what's going on over there. So yeah, at this point, that's kind of where our evolution is. We have learned how to swap hands when we're holding stuff, so I kind of want to see, maybe, what happens if I hold, like, two things together? I'm curious. Let's grab one. I can switch hands with LB, and then if I grab... Oh, I can hit LB to alter. Oh, that's just my hands. Hold on, and what if I grab another one? Can I, like, hit them together? Hold up. Alter? Altering and crafting. Once on the left hand, some items may be altered with bare hands or crafted. Interesting. So if I hold LB. Okay, hold on. I gotta hold it, then I hit RB. Oh, I can hit the rocks! I can hit the rocks! Woo! We're getting smarter by hitting rocks too. This is what I'm talking. I wish I could hit rocks instead of study for class. Bro, these dudes had it so nice. Eventually, this has to like. Come on. How much do I need to hit these dang rocks, dude? Oh my god. Is anything gonna come from me hitting these rocks? Oh, baby. Oh, I just broke the rock. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> um, why don't we go and grab maybe... Oh, we you know what we might be able to do? I think obsidian's a harder type of rock. We might be able to use it on a normal rock. Hold up, hold up, hold up. This could be incredibly cool. Can I use this on a normal rock here? Yes, let me grab one of them. And now can I alter? No, not that way. Can I switch hands? There we go. Now if I alter this, I might be able to like turn this into like a sharper rock. I don't know. What's going on with my eyesight, dude? Oh, we just discovered hitting! An obsidian can alter a granite rock. Yo, this is exactly what I was thinking about. Okay. Well, how, how'd this rock change now? 
What's so much better about this rock? I am curious. Let's inspect this. Not that one. That's just a normal rock. We've discovered that. But if I switch hands again, can I discover, can I inspect this rock? What have I done to this? This is a new rock. What did we just invent? We just discovered a granite grinder. I don't exactly know what that accomplishes for us, but fascinating. Huh. I'm gonna go ahead. Why don't I drop both of these things? You know what I think we might need? Are there any more branches I could eat? Okay, I'm gonna see if maybe I might be able to, right? If I switch hands, let's alter this. And maybe I could like, oh, I just destroyed that stick. Okay, not good. I'm gonna run out of sticks at this rate. <laughs> I'm just over here trying to invent stuff. The wild star trying to evolve. All right, let's go back to altering. And maybe just like hit it a little bit. Like maybe I could like. I'm just trying to like take these branches off. Oh! Oh, I'm breaking the branches off the stick! Dude! Am I about to invent a spear? Oh baby! I think this is actually happening right now? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Did your boy just invent a spear? Maybe? You gotta like wait till you hear that little noise and then if you hit it like progress discover a new alteration hitting an obsidian can alter a dead branch Okay, now what happens if I switch hands and inspect this? Did I just create a spear? What is this? What is this? New tool discovered a stick god. Okay, just a stick doesn't give us much Um, Can I switch hands? Can I like alter it again? Maybe? Can I like, make it sharper? Oh, I think so! Boys and girls, I see something happening to this stick. You guys see that at the bottom? It looks like we're kind of skinning away at the, uh, like, outside, the bark of this branch. Ooh! Boys! Are we about to invent spears? Because this will probably help us a lot with, uh, whatchamacall? Discover new alteration hitting? Bro, bro, hold up, hold up. Did we just invent a spear? Oh, baby, that bird is not gonna know what's coming for it. New tool discovered, a sharpened stick. Okay, can I sharpen this even more? Maybe? It says I can keep altering it. No! Well, there goes our sharpened stick. It was fun while it lasted, but at least we figured out how to make one of those, and we're kind of finding some pretty interesting stuff out over here that, well, let's just say I am very interested to continue checking out. Oh, I accidentally threw that thing. Yeah, we got some really cool stuff coming to say the least for now, though. I might, let's drink up some water. I think I'm getting thirsty. Let's inspect that. Can I drink this? Is this water clean? New food discovered. Water. Since when is water food? I don't know, but let's get to drinking that a little bit. Glug, 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 glug. Glug, 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 glug. Oh, that's right. Everyone else is like, whoa, Star's onto something. He's drinking water. That's right, baby. I'm an innovator. I sharpen sticks. I sharpen rocks. And now I drink the water. And have the world's first ever synchronized water drinking team. Olympic gold, here I come. So, I think we might be like done being thirsty. And yeah, from here on out, we probably just gotta go get a little bit of food, restore our stamina at the bottom, maybe get some sleep, but holy guacamole! Things are getting interesting. We're inventing stuff over here, and I think in episode two, if y'all do wanna see more of it, there's some very interesting stuff we can make happen. Why, why does this happen to my eyesight, dude? I'm still trying to get to the bottom of that. We still got some stuff we gotta explore. I'm gonna be completely honest, I kinda wanna have my sharpened stick before we start exploring so we can see how that goes. But uh, all in all, things are looking interesting to say the least. 
But with that said, with that done, that's going to start wrapping it up for this episode of Ancestors the Humankind Odyssey. If you guys want to see more and to see us continue evolving, advancing, and discovering entirely new things and how that affects our gameplay and what we can accomplish, I am more than game to make it happen. Why is my heart beating incredibly fast for picking up mushrooms? Are these new mushrooms? Oh, my guy likes. He likes the mushrooms. Oh, no, stay away. These are my mushrooms. God. God dang it, man. No, stay away. I think he just took the rest of my mushrooms, bro. Not cool. Not cool. We got other stuff we could eat, though. So I'm, uh... Oh, no. Did I mean to do that? We got other stuff, though, so we can continue eating. But, yeah. We're just gonna go ahead and continue our survival and... See where that takes us. Boy, that's it with that done. That's gonna start wrapping it up for this episode of Ancestors, the Humankind Odyssey. And the future is looking interesting and i want to see just how far we can evolve but with that said with that done that's going to start wrapping it up for me for now thank you guys a whole time for watching ha huh, this was an awesome one and i'll talk to you next one see ya